We are here at Sedan Machinery Showroom with plenty of machines on display, but today we're going to go ahead and go over the ProLink software that can be found on every sedan folder, from the K1530 to this K2540 combi behind me, all the way up to the Mega Pro. The ProLink control has been out since 2006. It can be found on 3,000 different sedan folders throughout the country. But what makes this control more impressive is its reliability, easy to use, and easy to navigate function. So let's check it out. The ProLink software has three different tabs, a search function, and two types of programming. Currently we're on the standard tab. The standard tab are where profiles that are included with the software, generic profiles, can be found. The custom tab are where profiles that are created with the graphic mode can be found. The line by line tab is where profiles that are created with the line by line mode can be found. To view your custom mode and standard tabs, um, in columns, you can click the tab again and it will generate the uh, column search to easily navigate through your profiles. To search for a profile, click the magnifying glass on the bottom right hand side, enter a key phrase or word associated with the profile you're trying to find, type it in metal, and it will generate in the three tabs any profile with the term metal in it. So the standard tab has zero, the custom tab has six, line by line tab has zero. To draw your profiles you have your line by line and graphic mode. Your line by line mode is as easy as adding your steps and adjusting the numbers across the board. So the first column you have your step, then you have your bend angle, back gauge dimension, clamping pressure, the opening height of your upper beam after each bend, the speed of your folding beam. This feature right here allows you to pause the back gauge fingers so that they can remain down before your next step. This gives your operator the ability to rotate heavy pieces or large pieces on the back gauge as opposed to taking it out of the machine and rotate it in the air. The, the number of plies you're clamping on, so if you're uh, double bending or clamping on a hem, you can adjust that to two so your material thickness will not think you're over clamping on thick material. The type of angle, whether it's a regular angle, hem or radius. This column right here is a feature if you have the combi beam on your machine. You can simply rotate it to the combi beam option. And last but not least, you have your part rotation. Your graphic mode allows you to draw your profile on, on the control. As simple as using the keypad here on the bottom right hand side. And above, the, above that, you can adjust your angle and then the dimension of your flange. It starts off at half an inch. If you continue in the same direction, it will double in size. So half an inch, inch, two. Simply hit the backspace. You can choose between a radius hem You have open, close, teardrop. I'm going to adjust that from 2 inches to 1.5. And then you have a J channel. You hit the magnifying, uh, excuse me, the, the flag once you're finished. And you can go ahead and double check your dimensions by either clicking the screen or you can use the arrows here on the keypad. Once you're finished, it will take you to the next screen where you'll see your sequence. You can see if you increase the size of your screen when you're forming your profile, you'll be able to see in each step in black the uh, pre-bend, in gray the overbend, and then in orange the spring back. When you're ready to form your profile, you hit play, and then you're ready to go. So there we have a general overview of the ProLink software.